know there's a Betty Eddie reporter. He knew and knows what's going on. He knows where the bodies, so to speak, are buried. Joe was just amazing. He was a wealth of information. Joe would feed pigeons, feed squirrels, any wildlife he would feed, and then he would bless them. I think the pigeons knew he was coming. We call him Bird Man. He feeds the birds uh, since I was a little kid. Birds know when he come, and squirrels too, but I can tell you they, the birds love him more than the squirrels. One thing about him, he was very well known for giving what available cash he had to the panhandlers in the Trenton, Trenton Capital area, and there were many of them out there. They called you St. Joseph and said you're the longest serving state house reporter in all of America. So that's what I'm told, yeah. That's, that's my understanding, yeah. What do you think about that? I'm glad I'm here. <laughs> I'm glad I'm still here. He's one of the nicest people on the planet in one of the toughest businesses in the world. Newspaper, journalism, and you're talking about journalism and politics in New Jersey, which is an even more concentrated form of difficulty. He clearly was a legend when it comes to knowing the ins and outs of Hudson County politics, as well as Trenton politics. I mean, there came a point when he knew everything about everybody. He represented the time when reporters really did their their background. He had his eccentricities, feeding pigeons and things like that. We'd butt heads, but there was a respect. Well, I've been feeding cats here off and off for 20 years. I just got in the habit of feeding her. She learned to, to trust me. That's why I call her Trusty. I can't think of a better name. Trusty the cat won't go to nobody else but him. He's feeding that cat every day. He's make sure he has his water, make sure he has his milk, make sure he has his food. And he'll sit here with the cat. I always knew that he was the cat guy, that he was like this really nice, sweet, humble man, somebody who cared for something more than he cared about himself. He's out there feeding the squirrels and the cats. And people may think that he's not together, but he's totally together. You know, remembers everybody's name. We'll talk to you about, you know, the very latest. The, the assembly passed it, but the Senate wouldn't do it. Conversations even yesterday. The sharpness is, is still there. Uh, he'll ask me questions about the budget down to the decimal point. Joe Albright was one of those guys who understood the historical perspective, um, understood how difficult it was to be governor. Hey, good to see you. Uh -huh. Yeah, you're looking great. Yes, thank you. God bless you. Jimmy, you're looking great. Thank you for good work. Thank you. I'll try to take care of my little cat. A whole lot of friends.